Very well. Be careful now! Begun. What manner of beast is this? It is begun.
has begun. You're back! Are the spiders gone? Really? Oh, that's wonderful. You've saved my hide, I'm sure. And I owe you a favor, so if you need anything, I'll be here. Exactly. Uh Welcome to the Circle stockroom of magical items. Rods of fire serve many purposes. Why do you wish to acquire this particular item? Some mages require them for their research. Others merely want to light fireplaces. I will set down that you require them. Here is the form, request for rod. I will release a rod to you once I have the signed form. Thank you. I trust you saw Duncan back to his quarters? I'm glad you met him. He's a most honorable man. Grey Wardens are peerless. We can... Now, did you need something? When he is ready. And how does he know this? I suppose the young initiate he dallies about with revealed it to him. You think I didn't know? I did not become first enchanter by keeping my eyes and ears shut. Gregor says he has proof and eyewitness testimony that Jowen has been practicing blood magic. I cannot say more. Were it left to me, things might be different. But the chant... I'm sorry, child. This rite of tranquility will happen. Oh, interesting. What more do you know? Yes, she must be helped. Do you know anything else? I suspected Lily would tell him of the impending right if she found out, but I never expected they would have the gall to break into the repository. Reporting him to Gregor and the Templars will accomplish nothing beyond what's already planned. If the Circle must punish one of its own, I will see the Chantry done the same courtesy. Lily will not walk free while my apprentice suffers. She is also breaking every vow she ever took. If we mention her involvement, the Chantry will say that she was framed. No, oh, she must be caught in the act. If you want to survive, you must learn the rules and realize that sometimes sacrifices are necessary. Jowen will become tranquil, but Lily must also face the consequences of her actions. How did you learn of their plan? Do they trust you? You felt comfortable enough to bring this to me. Do not shy from your duty now. A rod of fire? Why do you... Uh, I understand. Trying to break through the door this way. Interesting.
The phylactery chamber door is warded and resists all magic worked upon it. Hmm. Not easy breaking into a locked chamber. The phylactery chamber shares a wall with the artifact vault. Age and damp. You can break down this part of the wall to gain entrance into the chamber. We have an old Tevinter device in the vault. It amplifies spells. Use the rod on this artifact and aim it. The repository is deep within the tower. It's unlike. Besides, odd noises are quite commonplace here. One more thing. Do not be quick to suggest there is another. Make it seem like here is the form with my... Welcome to the Circle Stockroom of Magical... Everything look... Here is the rod you requested. Waiting. It makes me nervous. Really? What? Lily wouldn't jest about something like this. I saw it plain as day. And Gregor believes he does the Maker's work, keeping the mages in check. Of course not! I've been sneaking around to meet Lily in secret. Maybe others have seen me. I suppose we are, but they think it's blood magic, and it isn't. Maybe if it were just Irving, he'd spare me. But he has to keep the peace between the Circle and the Chantry. If he stirs up too much trouble, they might replace him. The Chantry abhors blood magic. That's why they're willing to pay attention to this stupid rumor. No, and I don't care. Why? I came here a year or so before you did. Mother stopped talking to me after I showed signs of magical ability. She'd mutter under her breath that I was a demon child and an abomination in the Maker's sight. She'd fight with my father. Guess that's what drove him to leave me at the village chantry. I suppose it's just as well. Ugh, it's the past. Are you ready to go? That was quick! To the repository then. Freedom awaits. <laughs> 